hey, what are you doing? Are you just sitting there doing nothing? Check this out, Denver is growing fast. I mean like rocket to the moon fast. And one of the fastest growing sectors is construction. And they need workers, like yesterday. You know what you should try? CAD BIM. That's what I said, CAD BIM. What is CAD BIM? Computer assisted drafting, building information modeling. Only the coolest technical part of the design of buildings, roads, landscapes, you name it. Do you like computers? Do you like designing stuff? Then Emily Griffith Technical College has the right program for you. Hi, I'm John, and in one year, this will be my career. Hi, I'm Vanessa, and this will be my career in 10 months. Hi, my name is Jose. This is my career in this 37 weeks. With nearly 30 certificate programs, you can go from classroom to career in less than a year. Let's get a little recap on who you are and what you do. Uh, my name is Matthew Burchette, and I'm the curator at Wings Over the Rockies, which basically means I'm in charge of all the stuff, from little tiny buttons to a B-1 bomber. <laughs> that all falls under my purview. We brought you here to tell us about some art, right? That's yeah, but a very specific kind of art. I'm talking about plain nose art. Ooh, ooh. So we've got some photographs that I have uh, brought. This, this is actually an AH-1G Huey Cobra, which was an attack gunship. And the guy standing there, his, he's the pilot, and he's named his Cobra Pillow Power. Why would you call like this massive Rawr. machine? Yeah, it's so scary. <laughs> Because the, in the helicopter, the pilot sits in back, and then the gunner sat in front, so he literally had to sit on a pillow to be able to oh, see over no. the instrument panel. How did Wisdom Industries start off in the first place? How did you get into this whole idea of making portable amusement park rides? Well, originally, we started out that uh, my great-grandfather started out with a carnival in 1908. I grew up on the carnival. I was moving rides when I was seven years old. In the late 50s, my father, he took a Ferris wheel, folded it up, and made it so that you can move it in an hour and a half with two people. Did you decide to go to school, to like engineering school to get an edge, or was it something that you've always been interested in? I'm just thrilled about how anything works. I've always been very inquisitive how, how a piece of machinery works in designing a piece of equipment. All of the ideas about structural, about structural materials, about metallurgy and all that stuff really doesn't amount to much until you know what forces are involved. Writing the words out actually, sure. just because that's part of the difficulty sometimes is decoding it. So yeah, you like, said, Julie has $50, yep. which is $8 more than twice what John has. So the question is, how much does John have? How much does John have? Okay. So um, let's decode this. Why does cutting onions make your eyes water? Oh which is uh, definitely an interesting question. So, Oh, that happened to me on air a couple when oh, we made yeah. kimchi. I think it happened to all I of us. I was just we were, crying. When we were making kimchi. Yeah, yeah. you could. Uh, so what was, what was going on was this. So when you've got an onion and you slice into that onion, uh, what's, what you're gonna do is you're exposing the inside of the onion and there's all these compounds in the onion, onion that contain sulfur. 